Hello everyone on the 8th Indian Cine Film Festival. I'm Federico Humada, director of Las Gardenias. I came up with the idea of making this film because I started to go to this uh, drama therapy session that uh, Jessica Nor Northam, the American drama therapist, was doing with these women displaced by uh, armed conflict in Colombia. So I was like filming the sessions. I didn't have like a big intention of making a film or anything about it in that moment. I, I was just feeling that I wanted, I wanted to do a little research about that and, and help uh, and help Jessica like achieve some goals with, with them. First of all, I didn't have any money. So I didn't have like uh, really any resources to actually uh, make the film happen. About, about uh, managing human and, and financial resources, as, as I said before, I didn't have like any big uh, budget. Uh, what I did it was like I kind of got some agreements with the crew, so I wouldn't have to like pay them right away, and I would like take my time to develop the project. Challenges. Well, uh, first of all, uh, this was a dangerous place, so we had to be really careful with uh, our gear. You know, uh, we had to. My camera was a small camera, so I kept it on my backpack and also like all the sound gear, we kept it like uh, really small. But most importantly, we, we gained the trust of people in the community. Like the work that uh, Jessica was doing with these women and, and got, uh, got us the, the opportunity to, to be really close to them and trust was really important and was built. It was very different what I envisioned at the beginning and what the film turn, turned out to be, because I wasn't really sure at the beginning where the story was going. I didn't know what the outcome of the process would be. I didn't know what was going to happen with the peace agreement. Everything, everything was just like, I don't, I don't know what is going to happen. I think the process helped me find out what I really wanted to, to, to say and to show in this movie and, and how it turned out to be. The target audience for this film, I think, is anyone who is interested in Colombian peace agreement process and also people who is interested in this kind of social work and how it, it really helps uh, people and communities who overcome difficulties life might throw at them. In this case, is, is war and is violence and, and, and it give, gives them the opportunity to change their lives. I think anyone who is interested in watching these kind of moving stories and can be a really good target audience for this film. I aim to, to reach many festivals, like documentary and, and independent filmmaking festivals. Um, so I can like show this, this, this type of work because what I really aim uh, deep down is like the possibility of people that would like to help these kind of social work programs in Colombia or in, in many countries. I think like I, I'm looking for a way to inspire people and, and organizations to support these kind of initiatives like Jessica's and like many other people around the world that want to help communities to, to improve. So after these uh, routes in the festivals and, and showing the film in the festival and, and, and all that, I really aim to show this film on, on communities like this one. Like, Especially in this community, like I really want to show the film to them and, and I want to show it to many other communities that might feel related to this women's story because what I really want to, to, to make is people to connect with this. People should watch this film because I think it, it will give them a different perspective on Colombian armed conflict and, and it will give you like a, a, a really good sense of what people really endure and what people go through and that everything is more complex than, than, than it seems to be, you know? So that's, the, that's why you should watch it. And to emerging filmmakers, I want to tell them, go for it. Like, really, if you have an idea and, or have a story to tell and you're passionate about it, don't let anything uh, stop you. Like, if you have no resources or anything, you, you will go through it, really. And just go, go for it. Best wishes for the 8th Indian Cine Film Festival in this 2020 year edition. Thank you very much, guys. I'm really thankful for having the opportunity to be part of this year's edition. Thank you.